everyone welcome back to beyond programming and in this video we'll look at how can we retrieve information from google sign in such as email the name the photo url all these uh, things we get along when the user signs in with the google uh, with the google account so in the previous video we saw that how can we simply sign in with google and in this video we'll see that how can we retrieve the data right so let's get started and right now our project is running we'll let it run and after that we'll start coding okay so our app has run here and now we'll sign in once and go to the home screen okay so this is a home screen just a blank screen with the uh, app bar on it so uh, for example as of now we'll retrieve three things and we'll make the variables for them and those will be final variable of type string which will be named as email and i'll duplicate that two more times and one will be photo which will be the main image of the email id and the third one will be the name let's say right so we'll add all of these three variables to the constructor we'll add the required keyword so now in the login dot dot we'll get an error in the home when we uh, call our navigator dot push function we'll add all the required the required parameters for the email we will give our user object the user object variable which we made in the previous video if you haven't watched that then please go watch that because you won't be able to understand this video if you haven't watched that so user obj dot email this will be our uh, email and then for photo it will be user obj dot photo url basically it returns the uh, for this we'll use a network image and the link will be given as the photo url and then for the uh, for the name display name so it's the uh, for the null safety we'll convert this to dot to string so that no uh, null is given to us and this also dot to string right and now for the uh, display of all these three items we'll make widgets in our column which we made so uh, two of them will be text widgets and the main content will be widget dot email we will duplicate that one time more and second will be our name widget dot name and third shall be our uh, network dot image image dot network and for the url we'll pass widget dot photo url so now we'll hot reload okay how to solve it by mistake we'll sign in and then here you can see my email my name and the photo is being printed i just skipped all the why part because that's not our main objective here and uh, the main information is now retrieved there can be other such uh, information also which can be retrieved i'll just show you so a uh, user object dot id we can return and the uh, several uh, server auth code this can be returned so these are other two things which can be returned and yeah that's it for this video i hope there were no doubts it was an e easy uh, 
task no such big deal or something so if you have any doubts or some errors you can put me in the comments or you can also dm me to my instagram handle the link is in the uh, channel page and if you have not subscribed yet then you should press that red button because all the filter updates are right here on this channel with the new version change things also and that's it for this video i'll see you guys in the next next one thank you so much bye bye Sometimes I struggle in this place been in circles several days never knowing the